If fear is holding you back from achieving your big dream, quitting your job and leaving your job and achieving the life that you really want, then ask yourself this, are you feeding your fear or are you making friends with your fear? You have a choice. The most common reason why we are stuck in a situation or a job that we actually don't like is because of fear. It is very common. It is very human. So don't worry, you're not alone. And I get it because I faced many fears. I used to be in a very successful corporate job that I actually hated and I wanted to get out. I had this big dream to travel the world and achieve the life that I really wanted, but I was afraid. And so I had to face many fears, but now I am creating and I have created that life that I desire and I am traveling the world. So it is possible. I'm so happy you found my channel to create the life that you desire, to overcome fears and change your mind and transform your life. Make sure you don't miss any of my new videos to inspire you and make sure to subscribe. So hit that red button right below and the notification bell so you don't miss any of my new videos. Fears are so common and I get it. I used to be stuck in the corporate world and I wanted to break free, but I had so many fears. It was overwhelming. But I made a choice and I broke through them. So I want you to listen carefully to the message I'm going to give you in this video and make sure you stay till the end because there's a free action step and a free gift for you. Focus on a fear always makes it worse. When I can relax enough, I become able to change my focus. I can put my mind on loving, supportive, constructive ideas. I can't make fearful thoughts go away. Struggling with them makes loom larger. Instead, I can redirect my mind to more peaceful, calming thoughts and circumstances. Every time I do this, I am choosing peace instead of fear. The more I choose peace, the more it becomes a part of my life. With practice, I get better at redirecting my mind. I learn how to spend less time focusing on fear. I grow stronger in my ability to choose helpful thoughts over fearful ones. I make time to relax, to reconnect with that space deep within myself that is always at peace. When I make time to do this, I can choose to move away from fearful thoughts. I can allow my mind to expand into a wider place that is much larger than my fearful thoughts. Fear requires a narrow, small focus of my mind. When I relax, my mind becomes deep and large enough to transcend fear. I'm learning to see that my fearful thoughts overestimate risk or threats. The true risk I face in most circumstances is actually very small. It's impossible to eliminate risk from life altogether. Being in a physical body in the physical world necessitates some risk. Only in heaven is there an eternal risk-free state. I'm learning to recognize my tendency to exaggerate risks and un 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 underestimate my ability to cope. If I take the time to examine my fearful thoughts, I'll discover that in most cases they are unreal. When I focus and choose to see most situations as they truly are, I can see they are not dangerous. If I practice replacing my fearful thoughts with real thoughts, eventually my fearful thoughts will diminish. Every time I feel afraid, I recognize the unreality of my fearful thoughts and let go of them more easily. The important thing is not to feed fear. Instead, I can practice redirecting my attention to something that makes me feel better. I can focus on taking talking to a friend, reading something uplifting, working with my hands, listening to a tape, or any number of activities that help me take my mind off of fear. With practice, I become more and more adept at moving away from fearful thoughts of not indulging in them. I begin to become a master rather than a victim of my mind. I learn that I have more and more choice about fear. I can step into it or out of it. And as time passes, I learn to step out of it. Are you stepping into it or 
out of it? Are you taking action to redirect and refocus away from fear? Tell me in the comments below, what is your biggest takeaway? What can you do to not focus on the fear, to not feed the fear, but take power and control your fear and redirect to more positive thoughts that make you feel better. Make sure if you still feel stuck to grab the grief, the free gift. <laughs> <laughs> make sure to comment below what are you doing what actions are you taking when you have these fearful thoughts and grab the free gift i have for you to get unstuck if you're still stuck and you're in a career and you want out you don't know how to get unstuck then grab that free link it's a training with seven steps to get unstuck right below this video if you want to talk and really discuss how to change and transform your life. I am here for you. So you can also find the link to book a call with me. I can't wait to read your comments and to see you in the next video. Now go and fight the fear and overcome it and face it and feel better. Not fearful, 